y'all see I got my mask on today. I wore my bling mask. Because y'all know I didn't wear this one for the party. I ended up wearing a white one I had in a bond from the resource store. Okay. Ooh. My brother over here because so my brother can't come over because I had called him. You all in the I had called him to see what he was cooking for lunch, which was nothing. So Yeah, he took some hamburgers out and left them in the thing. You ain't never put them back up. No, they just split. They were too funny. Mommy's here picking up her phone. Hey, hey, Wealth is coloring me a picture. Let me see a picture, put her. Let's show them their picture. Oh, that looks so good. I did the green over there, y'all. I don't like that. Greg, get your baby. He is hungry. My baby is hungry. Took over the past couple cookouts we done had. We didn't have a cookout you know, every weekend. And we still missing some folks. Bryce ain't on no right. Andre. Mm -hmm. Can you please stop crying? Come on, truth. Hell, that man. He had. <laughs> <laughs> Cool brother outfit today, but somebody's these two can keep theirs clean. Hmm. Ooh, y'all, we finna go to bed. But I wanted a fortune to open up his gift that he got from his goddaughter from Ari. Like, fortune is a great dad. Y'all already know that he's a great dad to the boys. But before the boys was here, he had him some god kids. And he got a whole bunch of them. Yeah, he do got a bunch of god kids. <laughs> but yeah, Fortune has been a great godfather to all his god kids for real. I don't know about the first ones, but I'm just saying. Fuck. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> but Ari and Robbie and Jordan. Y'all get y'all is full of them my girls. Come on, got our own girls, so shout out guys, sisters. We got the boys they ready to eat. Come on, my food. Open the shit up there. This shit looks so much bigger. He's cutting up. Hold on, bro. We ain't having that. Get you a pillow, too, Trip. I'm still looking like real big boy. Yeah. Step on him a little bit, too. Yeah. What are you doing over there? Get yourself out of that. Give it on the bed. Hurry up. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. Hurry up. Go. Ah. Got my little six fashion over pajamas on. Okay, babe. Back to you. Yo. With the Ari get you. She said she, Jordan said she made it for you. She made it. No. So I made it too. Hey. I can share that. 
Hey. Hey. Let's fight for a baby fight. Baby fight. Hey, Mimi. Hey. Can you see the camera? Hey. You're so silly. Okay, let's see that. Fight. My baby got me. Right, huh? Oh, you got you a oh, glass. You got you a new glass. You made that thing. Yeah. Right there, you see it. Oh, let's right, see that. Okay, oh, Omega Sci-Fi. Can they see it? Uh-huh. Oh. Put the paper back in there so I can see a best daddy in the back. You paper see better like that? The paper in it? Oh, no, because it's in white, huh? Mm -hmm. Oh, no, it's in gold. It's in gold. Yeah. Best yeah. sky daddy. Thank you. Bye. That is. Thank you, Ari and Jordan. Yeah, she said she made it with her um little creek up machines that I'm gonna get. Oh, that's what you getting to? Well, I told you I was gonna get it. I need to see how the functions. He can do a whole lot of stuff, man. Yeah, Sierra the one who told me about it. So you can do a whole bunch of stuff with the machines. I like it. Now we need to get some liquor. Then you can get some liquor. Not that Patron, the curve. Oh, sorry, buddy. Shining. <laughs> you got your glasses? Get some too, man. Get some. There you go. Put your glasses on, let Efo know what's up, son. Put them on. Put them on, son. Hurry up. Yeah. 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 You should have put the other ones on. They go with your pajamas. Hold the on, blue ones. Hold, hold on, bro. I got you. I'll be right back. Red. Where your blue ones at? Red. Huh? Y'all should tire them, gave them all nine. These good huh? goodie bags from the party. Yeah, yeah, I heard a hundred bag. Hey, well, where you put the other glasses? Hey. You seen the blue ones? Hey, what right here? You got them? No, he don't get him. Oh, 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 oh. oh well, y'all. I'm going to be seeing with his pajamas and his matching glasses today. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh man. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> y'all, every day this boy surprised oh. me. Oh, man. Every day he's talking about some new stuff, doing some new stuff. Oh. I love it. I love watching children grow. Thank you. Is he around me? Yeah, yeah, good job. You look rough with the camera, son. They always say you make them dizzy. When you get your camera, I can't remember moving it so much. Yeah, we in that thing. <laughs> <laughs> Show them all your teeth. Show them all your teeth. <laughs> yeah, ooh, boy, I'm about to get a grill. You ready to get a grill? Okay. I don't want to see all that, bro. Okay, that's okay. enough. Okay. 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 One more time, one more time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one back to Calvin, bro. Really? All right, child. Like I said, I'm about to go ahead and feed my babies. They're over here content because they got this darn ribbon. That's mine. I'm going to need that. Well, nobody want to see your little nasty tongue on my Put it back in your mouth. Put it in your mouth. <laughs> oh. To see you wanted to say hey. You have to say to the camera. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Bruh. You're real thirsty right now, bro. Sit down. You, you just say you want your milkies. Be careful, baby. Okay. What about you, Truth? Yeah, say be careful. You got anything to say? Fault isn't juice. Fault juice. Okay. I'm sorry. I guess I just like the pulse. Say hey. Ah. Uh. Y'all want it to be the thumbnail? <laughs> it depends on what the video is about. Uh, All right, y'all. Let me be my babies, and I will talk to you guys in the morning. Thank you. <laughs> What's up, gang? Look who's with me today. Rocco. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Rocco is with me, not by necessarily choice, but because he's split. When I was playing the boys in the car, he always be out there with us or whatever while I'm um, putting him in the car. And he used to stay in the garage and stuff while, while I'm out. Anyways, yeah, he decided he seen another dog 
in my little old neighbor down the street. He seen him outside and wanted to go play. So he ran down there with him. I almost got yoked up. But I had, I was already playing. Yeah, and I'll be by myself, so I'd be having to make multiple trips in the house. So wealth and truth was already, I was putting him in a car when he ran off. And Sincere was still upstairs. So I had to, um, I had to go get my baby. I was like, I'm gonna go get my child, Rocco. I'm like, sir, can you watch him for a second? I'm gonna get my baby. And it's okay. <laughs> so uh, I went and got Sincere and stuff and then, and then, yeah. I was running down the street. The guy had already knew where he was at. The guy was like, he right here. I'm like, okay. So, um, I just put him in the front seat and here he is. He's riding with me. I'm at his park. Um, I'm going to meet up with this girl who went to high school with me. She makes customized stuff. Oh, it's her right here. She makes customized stuff. <laughs> I haven't seen Louie in years since high school. Hi, Louie. <laughs> How you doing? How you doing? Good. I love this hair on you. Thank you. I was like, is that her little buns? Say hey. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Shout yourself out. I was telling them you do customize. Yes, I am the owner of Live Lit Customs, custom yes. t-shirts, custom apparel, custom creations, business branding, and everything. Yeah, yeah, she do it all, like for real, for real. <laughs> if you need anything customized, get at her. I know I'm about to get at you about some shirts and stuff. I'm going to need some. Oh, okay. Baby's so birthday party and stuff. Oh, yeah. Not to October, but I want to. Okay, I got you. Get everything squared away. It's both of them? Yes, yes. both okay. of them are in there. Okay, cool. Yeah, this was a gift. I was like, oh, snap. But oh. she ain't true. This is my cousin, Mika. Oh, okay, yeah. And for yeah. me. And for myself. She had hit me up about, um, I think she had wanted to get a custom off for her boyfriend or something mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 40, right? Yes. Thank, Thank you. you. Nice doing business with right. you. You been good? Yeah, how you been? I've been. All right, you guys. This is um her information right here. Live Lit Customs. Uh, you know, she already shot out everything that she makes. But she makes a lot of stuff. And I'm skeptical about showing y'all this because I know y'all be very judged. I'm just saying. Most of y'all. Most of y'all relatable. <laughs> Most of y'all are relatable and y'all, you know, whatever, whatever. But some of y'all are very judgmental. Um, but I guess y'all know me. I'm keeping it real. I keep it real. So this is what I ordered for her from her for a gift. And it looks so nice. <laughs> oh, she got her business card right here. So I gotta go again. Y'all see it? He makes this stuff, y'all. I paint it. I do all the customizing on it. So I don't know how ready to do this. Yeah. <laughs> live lit. Live lit. So, yeah. That's what I ordered from her. I love it. Thank you, Luann. <laughs> yeah. What's up, you guys? I'm back home. I have been out shopping, y'all. Your girl needed some retail therapy, okay? So, yeah, I went to the outlet, Tanger Outlets, because I wanted to get something to wear for 4th of July, even though I don't know if we really celebrate 4th of July. You know, we celebrate Juneteenth around here nowadays. <laughs> but not for real. Um, you know, 4th of July still coming up, like, real soon. So, I did get these. Um, oh, that just hit my eyelash. I did get these um, Fila slides, I mean, not slides, sandals last week when me and Fortune went to the mall and I seen them and I thought it was cute and he got them for me. So, yeah, they just right here. They're like ugly, but they cute and I think I can pull them off, but <laughs> and so they are like some little old man looking sandals, but they're gonna be cute on your girl because I know I can wear stuff. <laughs> but yeah. Just some little red, white, and blue um feet like sandals. So I was like, I need something to wear with this because I mean I probably got like red, white, and blue stuff to wear. Um, but I ain't had nothing. Long. I don't got no feet like stuff for real. So I want to go get something to go with these. So yeah. I got I wouldn't feel like I would probably get like a outfit 
y'all. I was just picking up stuff that I thought was cute. Let me put y'all back on top of this box. But yeah, I was just picking up stuff that I thought was cute. Be real. This is what I grabbed from there. So I got this fanny pack. It's a cute little white fanny pack. You know, the shoes are mostly white. So I thought this would be cute. Yeah. I got me some, what is this? These are my leggings, I believe. Yeah. I got some leggings. I ain't trying none of this stuff, y'all. And Lord knows, I don't know what size I wear in their clothes. I asked her how they stuff fit. She said, like, the stuff fit tight, but it's, like, big, kind of. I don't know. So, everything's, like, the stuff I got are, is, like, workout type stuff. So, that's why it's going to fit tight. But, yeah, I got this thing darn extra small. I don't know what the heck I was thinking. <laughs> but I probably can get my little butt in here. Because my bottom half, like, y'all don't got no ass. So, yeah, I just got these little um tights here. Do they even say feel like? Oh, they got the little F right here. So, yeah, I had got them. That's how my nail broke. I get my nails done tomorrow. Okay. So I got this to just go with like this plain white shirt. I just be simple on a you know day of the regular day of the week or whatever. And it got like the same little silver feel like so I can still wear that with the sandals though and the fanny pack. It's like a regular day outfit or whatever. Everything is pretty much like a regular day outfit. <laughs> but so that's not gonna be my fourth of July outfit. That's just something to wear. It's between one of these little two-piece sets I got that I'm going to wear for July. So, I got this, like, sports bra top here. It's cute. It's blue and white. And it got, like, a little cutout in the back right there. So, that's cute. And then I got these shorts to go with that. I thought this was a cute little set, so I could wear this for 4th of July. Learn to try these little big ass shorts. Oh, these are extra small. So why did I get an extra small? Why well, didn't just get a small? And I got my top in a medium, cause I know my my top is kind of bigger. My boobs, yeah, I know I breastfeed, so I get engorged and stuff. I hope the medium fit hell, cause I know my Nike sports bra is very very tight. Hopefully this medium fit. So yeah. I got this little set. Thought that was cute. That was cute with my sandals. So that's one of my options for Fourth of July. <clears throat> Another option that I'm kind of strongly going towards is like this skirt or this little, this little skirt. It's a skirt. It's a little white skirt, and this is a freaking medium. It's the only size they had, but it looked kind of small. So yeah, I got this little white skirt, and then I have. Like I can all this stuff can be alternated, like with the tops and the bottom and stuff. And then I have like this sports bra here, cute, and he got like some cute little cutout in the back too. So that can be an option for Fourth of July. And then I got this one too, this little outfit. This is what is this? This are my these are my shorts. Some navy biker shorts, and I got these just in a small. And this sports bra. And you got a zipper in the front. You got the zipper. So, yeah, I thought this was real cute too. So, yeah, yeah, that's what I picked up. I don't know which one I'm going to wear for the fourth, but it's going to be one of those. So that's all I got from Feline. Just stuff for myself. <laughs> I said I was going in there to get possibly a outfit. And your girl just was picking up stuff, okay? Just picking up stuff. And then I went to Nike because Fortune had wanted me to get him some socks. You know, I went to the outlet. So he said when I go to the outlet, get him some socks. So that's what I was going for and I was looking for my aunt uh, outfit because I know her birthday was the other day and I hadn't got her anything, which I feel so bad about. Um, so yeah, I was going in there for that. So that's what I did. And I got a couple more things because that's what I do. But my cousin, Nika, had bought my aunt um, um Nika had bought my auntie 
these shoes right here for her birthday, which are so cute. I love those. I had actually saw those in the store and I was gonna get them for myself. But y'all see it got like green, purple, coral, blue, da da da. I was looking all around for shirts and outfits and stuff to go with these darn shoes. It wasn't happening, okay? It wasn't happening. So I did find this one shirt that has kind of like the coralish color. I hope this match up good. I hope this match up good. But just a Nike t shirt. Just a Nike t shirt. And what else I got her? I got her. Um, Oh, and I got her some, just some black Nike tights. The shoes are black, and I feel like that'll be, that'll be cool. It's like a little cool. You know how I be dressing with my little Nike outfits. So, yeah, some Nike tights and a shirt. So, that's my auntie. I said, Fortune wanted some socks. So, they only had the white pack and the, the white ones in the six pack. So, I got him a pair of white ones and black ones. The black ones I just got a three pack. Because he got plenty of, like, hangs black socks so he don't need that many damn black Nike socks so this is a three pack <laughs> so I got him those I also saw when I was in line I had saw this outfit I know like the boys got 4th of July outfits already and then I had got myself that stuff so I was like babe he gonna be feeling left out cause he don't got nothing new to wear <laughs> so I had seen these shorts when I was in line in the window cause it was a line you gotta wait outside y'all and it was such a long line but I had just seen these shorts red white and blue Thought they was cool and cute. You know, they chill. You know, they like to just throw something on like that. That's what he like to do. And then this shirt right here. This is the shirt that goes with it. And then he got these little shoes that I like. They call, what he called it? What do they call? I don't know. I forgot what they call. <laughs> So that's what I got picked up for my husband. So I got my auntie, her stuff, fortune, his stuff. And then I just picked up myself these couple pair of Nike shorts. Just got like these pink ones. And I got my little pink Nike. So hopefully this go too. It looked like it'll go. I got these little shorts. And I got these shorts here. Because I got a lot of black tights that fortune got me. But I didn't get any shorts. I didn't have any shorts like the world, my sports bra and stuff. So, I just got these shorts here. And I wanted the um, tighter fitting ones, like the ones I got from um, Fila. But, them things is like $50. And I just felt, I did not feel like I needed to be spending that much money on some freaking shorts. So, these is on the clearance rack. <laughs> and they some black shorts. So, they're probably going to be loose fitting. But, I guess it'd be cool for me to not be walking out of the school with some little tight shorts on. So yeah, yeah, that's what I picked up today at the store. Like I said, I did a little retail therapy. I just need to go out and do a little shopping. So that's what your girl did. Um, I'm gonna have me something to eat. I had is some Jamaican food. They about pissed me off in there though because I went to Golden Crisp. And they have um and they have like a lunch special or whatever. And so I was like, let me get the lunch special. I wanted curry chicken. First of all, I had already asked like which one the curry chicken, which one the curry goat, because it all looked like pieces of chick pieces of meat. It wasn't looking like no whole pieces of chicken. Okay. So she goes to fix my plate or whatever. And um she do the rice and the cabbage and stuff first. And she put the chicken on. She put my gravy out of my rice. She put the chicken on. I see her pick up the little one, two pieces or whatever. And he closed the box. I'm like, that's how I like it. <laughs> I was on the phone with Fortune too, y'all. He was like, oh, here. Yeah. He's like, but I'm proud of you. But anyways, I'm like, that's all I get. And she was like, the lunch special only come with two pieces. I said, but it ain't two full pieces. Like, there's pieces of chicken. Like, there's pieces of meat. And she was like, it is. It is two pieces, but hold on. And then she went back there and I guess got the manager or whatever. And she was like, ma'am, how can I help you? I said, I just want two full pieces of chicken. <laughs> And yeah, she was like, it's this two pieces, but lady, I'm I'm looking at it. I'm looking at it. I had just asked which one was goat and which one was chicken because the pieces are little pieces. I got a little piece of thigh this big and a half of a fucking um, chicken leg. This is not two full pieces of chicken. If you went to Popeye's or churches or wherever the hell you go get your chicken from and they gave you, you got a two piece and they get your meat was this big. 
they have big got me well you're gonna be mad you're gonna correct them about that you're gonna check them about that so yeah don't get mad because i asked you like they had a big attitude and i had a big attitude back the fuck <laughs> so yeah got that handled um she gave me bigger pieces so I can give you another piece that I can give you. Yeah, just dig around in this pot, this little bowl thing, and um, give me some more chicken. I don't like to be real. I'm not like that. I usually don't complain. Fortune was like, I'm so proud of you because I usually don't talk up like that about my food. But I was hungry, and it was just not, not the time. <laughs> Whew. So, yeah, yeah, I'm sitting here watching my friend Keisha's vlog from, it's a couple days. Well, it's four days ago now. So, I'm behind a little bit. But, She's talking about finding some peace within this pregnancy. And she's talking about, like, how y'all be trying to diagnose the kids. Yeah, y'all. Y'all gotta chill. Y'all gotta chill. Like, what she's saying is all accurate. Like, even if something, like, to my knowledge, nothing is wrong with none of her kids. Her kids are perfect. So, like, for y'all to try to self-diagnose and say that, one of the babies might got down syndrome and y'all haven't seen this for so long it's like ridiculous like and but like she said if something is wrong with the child that's their place as parents to tell y'all that if they don't want y'all to know that then let that shit be like <laughs> watch what you gonna watch for in your entertainment we sit over here and record what we want to record for y'all entertainment and if they don't want to share that, if they don't want to share that, then if I don't want to share anything personally wrong with my children, I'm not going to share that if I don't want to. If I want to, I will. But if not, I don't. I don't have to. Nobody, no YouTuber is entitled to tell y'all everything about their life. And that's what people get confused. And they feel like they're so entitled. Oh, my gosh, y'all. This girl was writing under my pictures. First of all, I don't even get that much hate mail like that <laughs> i don't even get that much hate mail and if i do like i have my dms right here and it's my dms but then y'all see over here i got all these requests and i try to go through them sometimes most of them is positive and i accept them and respond or whatever but y'all i have all of these anytime i do go through these that is when i do see negativity somebody talking shit most of the time it's still good like i see a lot of hearts and you look cute like from what i just see right here so i need to go through those but this one chick i think maybe is a chick i don't know because their profile is fake the other day it was like after my i had left the coachella party so like i was up and i had started seeing comments coming through under my pictures am i gonna be able to see because i haven't posted two pictures since then and um i don't know if it's gonna come up but i think it was under recent pretty much recent pictures let me see let me see y'all shada was talking crazy though somebody had said what she say damn i know it was under this picture yeah she come in and said she must be on crack this is the person black and whatever the hell that's like black and sexy beauty she must be on crack i just come in and said why would you comment why would you make such an ignorant comment under my picture get the fuck out of here and she coming in under another picture she must have been deleting stuff or something because i don't know. I ain't seeing all the comments. But she says something about Oh, this was the picture she coming in. I knew it was a family picture. I was like, bitch, I know you did not just get on my family picture <laughs> with this stupidness. Why don't babies got bald spots on the back of their head? <laughs> she come in with that she coming in again she oh she responded to one of my co-workers too so that's crazy like one of my co-workers had i didn't even know i thought i would just come in and back so my co-worker probably seen it because she's seen a response on her picture mm. 
embarrassing. Like, that's embarrassing. Okay? So, don't come in on our pictures like that. I got family and friends, people who actually care. And you over here making false statements under my picture? Girl. But, um... She said lies. Baby got bald spots. Her husband got AIDS and smoked weed. Brit was a hoe in, in school. Big lips looking like Fantasia. I just come in back and said you are a whole idiot. She coming under another picture and said something about my brother being gay. Yeah. <laughs> First of all, everything she said is like not factual at all. It's not facts. It's not true. Some of my babies having balls pressing back of the head. <laughs> but y'all know babies have balls pressing back of your head. So I don't know if she was a parent or not. Our babies don't go through it. I got little boys. They be all over the place. And babies rub the back of their hair out. It happens to a lot of babies. Okay? So that's why my babies have balls pressing the back of their head. Will they have balls pressing back of their head? And I don't even like to say balls pressing back of their head. I don't like to say that because it don't even. The baby rub his hair out or it never grew in because they toss and turn and do all that type of stuff on the back of their head when they little. Wolf had the same thing, just like Sincere's hair. My baby got more hair than most people's babies, okay? So, <laughs> so yeah. Most little boys I know ain't got much hair as my baby got. So, yeah, he had that ball spot, but that shit grew in. So, yeah, my baby's hair gonna grow. And if they if it don't grow, we're gonna cut their hair, okay? So, yeah. But everything else... Husband having AIDS, that's stupid. So he don't want to get AIDS. Just him. I don't have it. If he has it, I don't have it. Our kids don't have it. He just don't want to get it. Okay. And no, none of us have AIDS. Stupid. Um, my brother being gay, he'll be pissed. I ain't even tell him that. Because he'll probably roast your ass so hard. He'll go in all on all in on your fake profile having ass. Um, my brother got a whole girlfriend. Before that. He had all the girls, okay? He's just in a relationship right now. And yes, no, he's not gay at all. Like, he is definitely a straight boy. He don't even show no gay time. So, that's what I'm tripping. Like, it's too, it's so many. And no offense to anybody who is gay because I don't care. Like, I don't care what you do in your, in your free time when you want to have sex and who you like and that. So, that don't, that don't face me. It don't have nothing to do with me. But he has a whole girlfriend. Like, it's so many gay folks in the world so many gay men so many gay teenagers kids you know what they look like okay <laughs> yeah people come out later on or whatever but my brother does definitely not show any gay tendencies so yeah and i'm around him a lot and i would know i would pick up on no signs he's not gay at all okay <laughs> um what else what else what else i don't know what else it don't even matter what else y'all said Whatever she said or whoever else gets my DMs and talk crazy. So, I decided, because I was with the shits that night slash morning. I was with the shit. So, I proceeded to DM her. I DM'd her first. Okay. So, she's never been on my page or anything. I don't even know if she's following me. Y'all look at the profile though. Look at the profile. A whole bunch of different black women they're not even the same person so it can't even be your fake self because this is different people in all the pictures in black bathing suits and it's a fake profile clearly we know but it says Chrissy so if it is Chrissy fuck you Chrissy <laughs> but um so I, I, I DM'd her at 2 30 a.m. on Sunday I say, stay the fuck off my profile with your ignorance. You lame as fuck, really, with your bored ass. Don't ask for attention from me with your fake profile. Let's see who you really is if you're going to pop shit under my pictures. Because let me be able to at least talk shit back about you. I can't talk shit about these fake ass, beautiful black models I see on your page. Because it's not you, clearly. So, she proceeds. And <laughs> she writes me back. Girl, fuck you. Go find out why your brother gay with his retarded ass and why your husband cheat. Big lip ass hoe. Y'all YouTube bitches make me sick. Especially Keisha in denial about her kids having Down syndrome. She dumb too with the man that won't even marry her. People always trying to come to me telling me something about Keisha. And vice versa. She tells me that people go in her DM talking shit. Or telling her whatever about me. 
y'all you don't gotta do that that's my friend we talk on a regular basis <laughs> um yeah first of all i saw this yeah leave my friend name out your mouth especially when you're talking to me because what what like i just told y'all like <laughs> Don't worry about her kids. Don't worry about her man. Like, that is her life. And don't tell me about it. Like, that's my friend. I know what's going on in her life. But none of that is, like, even relevant or matters or true. So, yeah. That's what she told me. I said, LOL, you have the wrong Britney, clearly. Nothing you saying about me or my family is accurate. You can't tell a lie to the source. That's what's wrong with you non-fucking factors like yourself. I don't know why you want my attention so bad, but hey, groupie them, you wish you was me in real life, miserable asshole. <laughs> yeah, well, that's what I told her. I was on the way to the lake with my husband at this time, and I'm over here arguing with this nobody ass because I was with the shits that day. And I just wanted to see what all she had, to, what other, what lies she had to tell me about me. You know, that that be the thing. This would be, this would be tripping me out because you can't tell, you can't tell me stuff about me. You can't try to like. Same like with Keisha. You can't tell her her child has Down syndrome. She know her child don't have Down syndrome. You can't tell me. My brother gay. You don't know my brother. You see the few. He don't even vlog. He not even part of it. Like he. This uh, the Marshalls party of five. The Marshalls is me, my husband, and my kids. My brother. Yes, my parents, my family on my be on my channel, but it's not their channel. So I don't talk shit about my family because it's very offensive. Like I said, it's not gay. So yeah, first of all, um, what else she said? Your husband cheat, y'all. Have I ever came to y'all and look hurt, miserable, sad, or anything about my husband, about my man being a cheater? Have y'all? That's the one thing I can say about my man, for real, for real. We ain't ever had no infidelity issues. That's not a concern for me, okay? I know my husband. <laughs> I know my husband. People do do what they want to do when they want to do it. But I know my husband. Okay. We kind of a lot more tight knit than that. I know his every move. I know where he's, where he's at every single day. And not that I'm even like checking him like that. It's just we are real couple. We're like we don't have no secrets like that. Like I know what he does. He goes to work. He comes back home to us. Every day. So if my husband is cheating, he is doing a great job at it. But baby, that ain't the case, okay? And yeah, so what else did she say? Da, 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 blah, blah, blah. Yeah, that's what she said. And she said, girl, bye. Go take care of them kids. Go clean your messy ass house. Always trying to vlog. I'm done talking to you. Tell your bald-headed mama to grow some hair. Enjoy your day, ugly ass. Big lip, whole suck dick for a living. Okay. <laughs> Am I gonna, I'm not gonna break down the rest of this. I mean, I can't break it down because it ain't that's the last message she sent. Um, I'm just gonna tell y'all what I responded. I just want to go take care of my kids. What she said first. I said, "Best mom alive. My house actually don't look too bad right now. Thank goodness. My mama cut her hair by choice. Baby Ben had inches. Fuck you saying. And nah, uh, I don't suck dick for a living." But just know, when I do suck my husband dick, I put in um, parentheses very often, <laughs> that shit fine. Let me know if you need lessons. Bitch, yes, I got big lips. And sorry, mom, older people, anybody who's watching this, your girl is fine when it comes to pleasing her husband, okay? But guess what? That's my husband. And before he was my husband, that's my boyfriend, and I still was fired at the end. And so that's why I, I got a ring. <laughs> Just sorry, that's not why I got a ring. It's a combination of things. But uh, yeah, yeah. So yes, if I do suck my husband thing, okay. Yeah, I do. If you weren't sure, if you needed to know, and I'm fine. Okay. So yeah, if you do need lessons, let me know, bitch. And yeah, my mama hair, bald headed. My mama cut her hair. Y'all remember my mama, my mama. I mean, this year, I don't even know how her hair was. My mama been had long hair. My mama grew up with long hair. Over the years, women grow up. My mama is 45 years old. She done cut her hair. She wanted to change. She cut her shit. Okay. Most people, a lot of people cut their hair. 
you gonna just gonna call them bald headed like that like some, some girls from here bitch fuck you <laughs> first of all and whatever the hell's the hair she said but it's just like people feel so entitled to say stuff like shut up you are not entitled you are nobody i don't even know who you are clearly i definitely don't even know who you are because you got a fake profile so like i said pop shit and pop shit with your real profile if you're gonna say something to me home girl home boy whoever you is probably little something I ain't, man i ain't even gonna even say it but yeah pop shit pop shit to me bitch they got a video call on this thing Video call me if you got some shit to say up uh, to me, bitch. We can go at it, okay? Because I ain't going to stay on the finest thing in the world. Because I know it's plenty of bitches out here better, better. But I'm bad, okay? I'm bad. I know this for a fact. And so, bitch, you probably don't look half as me. That sound real conceited, like. Bitch, you probably don't look half as bad as I do. In a bad, good way, okay? <laughs> well, in a good, bad way. That's what I meant to say. Probably don't look half, half as decent as me. Bitch, you don't, oh yeah, okay. I'm going in too hard. <laughs> yeah, I saw this bitch. She want to be me in real life. Bitch, the fuck? Bitch, you, you love this life, huh? You look at my vlogs, you be like, oh, I want her husband. Oh, I want her kids. Oh, I want her family. I like her mama, her daddy, her brother. They relationship so good. And thank y'all for everybody who really do feel like that because that's how you should. That's all I try to show is good family vibes. Like, that's all I put out there for the most part. Unless I'm having some random drama going on at random points in my life, which I don't. I'm a drama-free person because I don't have drama. Like I said, I mind my business. Me, my husband, my kids, my family. That's it. That. That's all I be around for the most part. I got a couple friends who I talk to and y'all know who them is, folks is, because y'all see them folks. But besides that, mind my own damn business you need to mind yours like i said i make these videos to entertain also i make these videos because i like to see my my wealth love my, well, all my children now but wealth here be like my let's watch our show let's watch my show let's watch your show which means talking about the vlog he love to see himself pulling up on his four wheeler at the beginning of the, when he hear that song come on from somewhere from another room if he in another room and i'm watching that he finna run in here Okay, he love to see himself on the screen. My kids love to watch themselves on the vlog. So that's why I vlog for us. I like to go back and watch vlogs. Because I like to keep these memories going or whatever. And I like to just see it and it's cool. And a bitch make money off of it sometimes a little bit. Not that much, but we're working on it. <laughs> but yeah, like, just be entertained. Like, folks be feeling so freaking insane. Idol. oh my gosh that should be ridiculous how i don't want to say y'all but i'm gonna say y'all because that's who i'm talking to i'm talking to the, the negative folks who always got some negative say. like thank you for all the positivity and your girl i ain't gonna lie your girl gets so much positivity but you always had them random ass folks who don't be talking about shit i can't talk about shit for real for real for real for real like man you ain't even oh gosh like i don't even want to get on it because it don't matter to me and all that shit don't even get to me like that i like i said i was with the shits i had been i already turned for coming from my friend Chella party i was already turned came home i was up you know and i seen that damn them damn comments come through under my pictures and i was with the shits and it continued on to the morning and i was still with the shits so, and if she would have kept responding to me, I would have kept responding to her ass more than likely. Because I be with the shit sometimes. I don't know the fuck you thought I was. I don't know who you thought I was. I don't know where you, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Now be what the 
yeah, I'm pretty and I'm all grown up, but bitch, you gonna get done up if you decide to just run up. And that's a line straight from Lady Dime, okay? Real talk. Yeah, I'm pretty. I'm a whole wife and a mama now. But baby, you don't want these. I don't even know if I can still fight. I'm sure I can, because can you lose that shit? Because I used to have them beat us back in the day. But yeah, I don't know. Like, am I finna fight somebody? Cause that's like that's crazy. Like we grown as fuck. But like I said, bitch, if you decide that you wanna fight me, that sound crazy. I sound crazy. I'm a whole ass grown ass woman, mama. And folks out here be saying shit that wanna fight. Like you wanna fight, huh? Cause y'all don't even know me like that, bitch. We can take this shit to the streets. For real, for real, bitch. I right, come on. Come on. I ain't one I ain't I ain't one of them soft fucking bitches for real. Uh, that ain't me. That ain't me. So don't don't try me. I remember before. I'm talking too long. This clip is going way too long. I'm finna just have to end the vlog after this. But um, I remember one time before somebody was popping shit on my vlog. Come out. Her family full of da 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 da. She got like talking shit. I think I was pregnant with the twins too. I'm like, yes, you're right. I do have a whole lot of felons in my fucking family, bitch. This the one you want to try? Bitch, I ain't, I ain't, we ain't, we ain't sweet over here. We ain't sweet over here. At the time, like I said, I was pregnant. So I said, bitch, I ain't gonna, so I ain't gonna to fight you, but just know, I got plenty of folks. Plenty of folks. Who will go, who will, who will go for your girl, okay? But I'm gonna go for myself, so it don't even matter. I'm gonna go for myself. I got a lot to live for. I got my kids to live for. Ain't nobody finna be tonight here threatening me and talking crazy like i said whatever you're saying is stupid and inaccurate you don't know me if you did know me the only i keep few things like few secrets from y'all i don't have just like secrets that i'm just like keeping it's just some things that i shouldn't share because that shit might not be appropriate from youtube and folks be so judgmental sometimes but for the most part, y'all know me. And really, y'all can still see what the fuck I'm be, what be going on. You still know if you really know. But if you don't know, you just don't know. And I ain't gonna just share it with y'all. But, yeah. That's all, y'all. I'm finna, um... It's, what time is it? Oh, my gosh. I've been just talking to y'all. It's 4.19. I gotta get my kids in about 40 minutes. So, I'm finna sit right here, fold some clothes, watch some YouTube, and do the boring shit that I do. Like believe me it ain't no extra extra shit going on over here for you to feel like you didn't need to be like all in your girl business and talking shit about her like that why you want to talk shit about me why you want to go and do that love me or hate me but if you hate me don't watch me but if you can watch me if you want to but just don't leave, leave that shit to yourself leave that negative shit to yourself i don't like negative vibes i'm a positive bad person and if you rock with me you already know your girl positive so what's up folks what's up gang 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 Bye y'all. Talk to y'all later. <laughs> and why I still going? <laughs> y'all cute. That's hard. Yeah, that's hard. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> Happy birthday, Kayla. Happy birthday, Kayla. Happy birthday, Kayla. Happy birthday, Kayla. We are ground, ground, girl. Ground, ground.